When I was first introduced to the world of essential oils in 1998, Blue Lotus was one of my first introductions. As I started to look at the history of Blue Lotus, to understand how the Egyptians used it to rise up to a higher state of consciousness, I wanted to learn more about Blue Lotus. The Blue Lotus I had smelled was completely synthesized in a laboratory, and I was devastated to know that it wasn't pure. And everything in the market is synthetic. Nothing has been pure. I just came to the conclusion that there was no pure Blue Lotus on the planet. Our sourcing team searched the world over, and guess where they found? So we're here in Guangdong province in China, one of the areas where we source our beautiful blue lotus flowers to produce the amazing extract. This place is very special because there was nothing on this land before, but we actually digged ponds and uh, bringing water from the mountain, we were able to then grow those beautiful flowers and create a lot of jobs for the farming community. We're here with uh, two Hello. ladies oh, from the farming actually. community. Hello. Hey, and, Simon. <laughs> and they're working here in the Blue Lotus mm -hmm. Pond. So they're explaining to us that they're picking up those snails in the ponds um, to make sure they don't eat the leaves. They're removing those little weeds in there. They're doing replanting. Uh, they're doing some harvesting as well. They're just very happy to be working with this kind of, uh, doing this kind of work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to see these beautiful blossoms coming up and out of these ponds and to see the women out there harvesting these flowers, it was an emotional moment. They are very grateful for this new job opportunity here because otherwise they'd be working in an animal factory or something like that, whereas here they work with a beautiful flower that smells very nice. So for them, it makes them really, really happy. How long has she lived here? She's a thing you see here. Um, more than 50 years. 也是特别喜欢的那种，所以我们就一拍即合，就把这个项目就做到现在的这个样子了。呃，中间的话，反正也遇到很多困难了。呃，在你们的支持下，我们都已经解决了。这里面有我需要以后。there is a Chinese phrase, Chu Yu Ni Aboran. What it means is to be unsoiled, to be incorruptible, to be principled. So when you think about the blue lotus flower, it is rooted in the muck and in the mud but yet above rises this beautiful, beautiful, glorious blossom.